destiny still alive. But this... What's going on, moviegoers? So if you're new to my channel and you like movies and nerd stuff, then make sure to hit that subscribe button and enjoy the show, you guys. Action. What's going on, moviegoers, movie lovers, and movie fanatics? So, with 2017 coming to an end, we go into 2018, which has potentially of being the greatest year for comic book films. And 2017 was a great year. With that being said, will Thanos live up to the hype the 10 years of teasing the Mad Titan Thanos. Kevin Feige, the man, the myth, the legend himself said, within the first five minutes of Avengers Infinity War, you will know why Thanos is the just the, the best villain in the MCU. Now, I kinda have a feeling I know where he's coming from, from reading the Infinity War comic. Because when Thanos first gets that glove and then Death was like, get rid of 50% of, of the population of the universe. And he just walks on over to the edge and just, just like that, boom, 50% of everybody is dead, gone. So I have a feeling we might get to see something like that. Because if that's true, yeah, Thanos is definitely going to live up to the hype. He's definitely going to be one of the best villains the MCU has ever had. And my, so far, my favorite villain that the, that the MCU's ever had, fuck, I, wanted, I really enjoyed Hela. Um, the Vulture, of course. Uh, da -da -da. Winter Soldier. I, was, I would consider him a villain. That's just me. Uh, Loki's, Loki's up there as well. But I'd have to go with Hela. Hela's been my favorite villain so far. But Thanos is about to be on a whole nother level, you guys. He's about to be just wrecking everybody's shit in this movie. And I can't wait to see it, man. I really can't. I can't wait to see Josh Brolin as Thanos. It's been going on for 10 years, man. Little snippets, little teasers and stuff like that. You know, we got we got like our first real glimpse of him in Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 1. And that was cool. Um, but I can't wait for Infinity War. I, I definitely think he's going to live up to the hype, you guys. He's, he's going to wreck some shit. And he's definitely going to kill some Avengers. Definitely. And I feel like that scene where he slams Spider-Man down to the floor in the trailer and then you see like Tony like he looks like his hands covered in blood and he's just like this. I feel Spider-Man dies in that scene. I wouldn't be surprised, man. Like I expect some big people to die but then I expect some to come back to life if Doctor Strange uses the Time Stone. That's just me, man. But, man, I can't wait. I think Thanos is really going to wreck shit, you guys. I'm super excited for Infinity War. We have Black Panther in damn near a month and a week or so. So that's that's going to be fucking amazing. I can't wait to see Black Panther. Definitely going to go to the fan event. I always go to these fan events, man, especially for these Marvel movies. They're just so much fun. And you get some cool shit, too. And you get to see all this exclusive stuff. So I thoroughly enjoy it. All right, you guys. We'll post your comments down below. Let me know if you really think Thanos is going to be... What he's, what he's meant out to be. Like Kevin Feige said, the best villain in the MCU. Let me know. Post your comments down below. And let me know what villain you guys want to see for Phase 4 since Marvel did require the rights to the X-Men Fantastic, Fantastic Four. If it was up to me, it would be Galactus or Doctor Doom. All right, you guys. I'm out of here. Peace. We out. We out. We out.